Um, hey guys, um, hope you're well. So uh, today we're going to look at uh, probability, right? And I'm going to work through these questions that I used uh, for um, a, a previous video using Mathematica. Okay, cool. So on a side note, guys, I'll really appreciate it if you do subscribe to my channel. So if you like what you see, uh, please do subscri subscribe and please share the videos with your friends. Cool, let's get started. So from simpy, uh, dot stat import mustar then from simpy again import mustar right and then um, my symbols so x y uh, z symbols so x y and z right and then um, uh, in it printing so just to print um, nice answers right okay cool so let's get started so calculate the probability that X is less than or equal to 3 okay so X is equal to right so actually hold on sorry it's normal there And um, I mean zero, my standard deviation is one. Right, so probability that x is less than or equal to three. Yeah, I'll get a symbolic, uh, a symbolic answer, but I can actually get a, a, a numerical value, okay? So round, then n, I'll copy that. So come on, copy, and then paste that in there. Right. Okay. Uh, I'll go for five decimal five decimal places. There we are. So that's our probability there. Okay. Okay. So working on to the next uh, question. So calculate the probability that two dice will yield a sum of four or seven. Right. So x y equal to die so my first die will be x six-sided die right and the second one die will be y also six right and then um, sorting in the first answer uh, the first um, first question of the die part so um, so probability then end right um, X plus Y uh, is less than or equal to 4, right? And then X plus Y is less than or equal to 7. We got a half, right? So I'm just going to copy that. Save me time from doing it all again. Right, and just change the values. I'll change that to 3, and then the next one is uh, 5. So call that. Okay, cool. Um, so the next question. Um, so the mean number of calls that Corby receives in a day is 4. So calculate the probability that Corby receives 6, six calls in a given day. Right. So I'm going to create um, a formula. So def, then poisson. Excuse me, French. Right, so return, okay, um, so mu, that's the mean, exponential x times, so times um, exponential minus mu, right, and then divided by factorial. X. This is, this is the reason why I imported that SimPy library so I can get um, mathematical functions like factorial and stuff, right? Um, cool. So now calculating that, right? So Poisson, right? So my mean is four and my x value is six, right? Just to get a numerical value of that. So come on, copy. 
and then paste that in there. Actually, let me round it. So round. Five decimal places. There we are. Cool. So that's the probability that um, um, Kobe um, received six calls in a given day. Okay, right. Um, so the the last one. So a new breed of maize or corn seed has a probability of 0 0.7 germinating. So Tanya plants six of those seeds. So what's the probability that exactly four of the seeds will germinate? Right. So x again, and then binomial. So you use, you use the binomial um, distribution if um, you're looking for a success or failure, you know, that sort of thing. Right, so x, that's my name, and um, right, so i got my, uh, i got six of those, six seeds that are planted, right, probability 0 0.7, that's given, and then exactly four of those seeds will germinate. Right, and then density. So they'll, they'll call the uh, the PMF of the binomial distribution. Right, okay. I can also do it using the binomial formula. Right, so I'm gonna have to create it. So def, then binomial. Number of trials, probability, and success. Right, so return, so factorial, factorial n, right, and then that's divided, factorial, of times, factorial again. n minus s okay just to make sure that I've done it right right and then that's divided uh, sorry that's multiplied so my bad but p uh, times um, not exponentiated sorry and then times 1 minus p exponentiated uh, n minus s. Right. So uh, binomial so that'll be 6 uh, 0 0.7 and then uh, 4 Voila, so there we are. So I just created the binomial for formula, you know. Um, right, so hopefully this was helpful, guys. And if you like what you see, uh, please do subscribe to my channel and uh, please share the videos with your friends. Right, cool. So on a side note, yeah, have a lovely day. And please do subscribe. Bravo. Cheers, guys. Bye-bye.